Out today, just going to do a, a quick little hunt and a little park, schoolyard, a couple little small soccer fields. Got the uh, regular F75, and we'll see what we get. A zinc signal. About two inches zinc penny. Another one here, this one's closer to the nickel range. It's a little bit high for a nickel. So that was about an inch and a half, a little ring, probably a kid's costume jewelry, had to clean it up and look at it, being those numbers, it's definitely, wouldn't think gold, so it's probably just costume jewelry, but that's cool, it's a ring. Yeah, I cleaned it up and you don't know if you're going to be able to see that, it says 925. So, silver, I guess since it's just so small, it was just hitting a little higher than a nickel. Or maybe the broken band, I just went over the coil outside the ground, it's still hitting 34, so, there you go. Got a nickel signal. And that was about a four inch tin lid. Just for reference. That's a surface pencil eraser. Similar signal. But it's not on the surface, but pretty close to it. We'll see what it is. Nickel. Got a quarter signal. Super shallow, got that double B. Surface quarter. Another nickel signal. Lots of other stuff in here. Pencil eraser. Make that two pencil erasers. Rescan the hole, and three inches away was another one. Here's a real trashy spot. Let's see if switching it to uh, FA mode helps us out any. 
to dime. dime signal. You notice this one ten points smaller. Just pop that on my scoop here about three inches. It's almost like a zinc penny. There may be more in the hole. I'll have to check it. Okay, that last one was a copper penny. Just came out looking kind of like a zinc to me. So I got a quarter signal here. It's gonna be the last one I dig today. Quarter. 